college football 25 road to glory. And this video is made possible by the EA Creator Network. And remember, this build I'm playing on is a work in progress. Today marks the start of our senior season, and we've been through quite the journey. We redshirted at Sam Houston and transferred to the Ohio Bobcats, where we struggled to get wins, but developed ourselves as a quarterback to hopefully become a solid transfer portal option. Sorry, Ohio. And that's when we found a three-star program that really had interest in us, the North Carolina Tar Heels. We transferred to the Tar Heels and had an amazing season with our stud wide receiver, Emmanuel Cantu. Despite this though, it was a heartbreaker in the college football playoffs, losing a close game to LSU. And in college football, it's kind of hard to come across loyalty, but we stayed with the Tar Heels. We owed them a little bit more. And in that junior season, not only did we win the Heisman, but we went all the way to the national championship and made North Carolina a four-star program. And now headed into our senior season, we're back to another very difficult decision, the transfer portal. Here's my stats over the seasons. You can see some steady improvement. 3,000 yards, 23 and 10 with Ohio, almost cracking 4,000, a great season, but not quite enough until we threw for 4,400 yards, 46 touchdowns and seven interceptions with almost 300 yards per game on the Tar Heels and won the Natty. Now, I really wanted to stay with North Carolina because I feel like the program's done so much and we built such a beautiful squad, but, and that's a big but, I feel like I've proven everything. We won the Heisman, we won the Natty. What else can we do with North Carolina but repeat, I guess? So I'm entering the transfer portal for my senior year, but that brings up another question. Virtually every program in the world wants the Heisman, right? I mean, take a look at the five-star programs. Right now, we could be a starter at LSU, which would be the best team we've ever played for. We'd be second string at Clemson or Alabama, which is a huge mistake, but whatever. And we'd be a starter at almost every single four-star program in the nation. Michigan, Notre Dame. But here's the thing. Why go to a five-star? I just won the Heisman. I just won the Natty with a three-and-a-half-star program. What would I be proving? I can do the same with a better team. Also, just for the record, I'd be a walk-on at Texas and Georgia, and I get it. You've got some studs. But Indiana? Hoosiers, you out of your mind? You're a two-and-a-half-star program, and you would bench me? They got some balls over there in Indiana. One thing I do know is I want to head to the Big Ten. The Big Ten's my alma mater. I love Big Ten football. I went to Michigan State, but I'm saving Michigan State for an online dynasty. So our options are Rutgers, Michigan State, Northwestern, Wisconsin, Penn State, Maryland, Iowa, UCLA. Now, I do kind of like the prospect of Iowa. Iowa's got, it says 84 offense, 85 defense. I've watched Iowa Hawkeyes football. That should probably be a 70 offense and a 90 defense, but whatever. But I'm throwing a curveball at every single one of you. Not only do the Maryland Terrapins have some of my favorite uniforms, but they're kind of lost in the shuffle of Big Ten teams. I feel like we always talk about Michigan, we always talk about Ohio State, and this upcoming year, we'll be talking about Oregon and USC a lot. But what about Maryland? I'd be a starter today at Maryland. They're a three and a half star program, and I want to prove that we could do it with Maryland. Now, we won't have Emmanuel Cantu, our 99 speed, six foot three demon, but we will have whatever Maryland's got. We are committed to the Maryland Terrapins. Now, I don't know how many Heismans would leave their national championship team, but but this is the story of Matt Maher, not yours. I'm going to Maryland, baby. And the first thing I gotta do, I gotta see the roster. What kind of squad are we looking like at Maryland? Ooh, yay, I am the best player at Maryland. <laughs> That's not what I was hoping for. <gasps> Isaac Godwin, 99 speed. Somehow that's a decrease in his speed. Do you have 100? He's 6'4". He's Emmanuel Cantu on steroids. 99 speed, 95 excel, 95 agility. Oh my God. Wait, we got Emmanuel Cantu plus one inches. I love having extra inches. 99 release, 98 deep route running. Yeah, you were literally built to catch the deep ball. Okay, <laughs> you can't ask for much more than that. My backup quarterbacks aren't so great. So our job is very secure. Our halfback starter is Nolan Ray, 87 overall with 89 speed. That's all right. Doesn't matter their age, because this is my last year of college football. Fullback is dog water. And the depth at wide receiver is also Makai White, 6'2", 96 speed. And we got Sean Williams, a team captain. So is Isaac Goodwin. Godwin, sorry. Okay, tight end is is uh, ugly. Dalton Kowalkowski. Not exactly a receiving threat. He's actually a blocking tight end. I think what I'm noticing early is this defense is nowhere near as good as North Carolina's. North Carolina's defense really, came, any game that I struggled in, dude, North Carolina's defense was there to back me up. We don't have a lot of studs. There's Brandon Jacob, a solid free safety. We've got Earl Culp, a relatively fast corner. Thomas O'Neill, Jonathan Akins. Yeah, the defense is not there. Maryland went six and seven last season, so it should be pretty easy for us to turn this program around. Taking a look at this schedule is really exciting for the Terrapins. So first three games, 
Wins, Virginia Tech, FCS Midwest. We get a bye, then Boston College. Hoping we can win two out of the three here. Then we got Rutgers, hopefully a win. Washington will be a big game. Indiana will be a big game. But the first game I'm going to play is against Ohio State. The last time I played Ohio State, we got smoked. It was the probably one of the worst games of my career. So this is where I want to step in. Then we got Michigan State. We've got the fifth in the nation, Minnesota. We'll see how good they are when we get there. Then we got Michigan and UCLA. So the end of the schedule is gnarly. Of course, the biggest thing for us is making the college football playoffs. So it would be a huge bummer in my senior season not to make the playoffs. Season is off to a hot start. We're 3-0 and and we're hosting Rutgers, who's 3-1. and We squeaked past Boston College and a huge dub against the FCS Midwest. And in the season opener, Smack Virginia Tech 2, we're putting up really good numbers. But I gotta say, my favorite part about right now, take a look at my weekly agenda. You'll notice something. I'm clueless academically, why? Because I graduated. So I registered in my freshman year, I didn't even think about this. I finished college. I've got a bachelor's degree in fucking sock puppetry, I don't know. But I don't have to study anymore. I literally can dump all of my points into XP, leadership, recovery, whatever I want. I'd be an influencer this year if I want. I do like increasing leadership though, because you get a multiplier on your team's XP which means that the players on your team develop faster. Dude, the Terrapins are ranked, baby. 22nd in the nation. I mean, we haven't played a very legitimate team yet, but we are breezing through the teams we're playing. And we beat Washington too. The Sim is treating me very nicely. Indiana sucks too, so hopefully this is another easy win. And I've got tons of skill points to spend. Don't need to use them right now. Also severely risking an injury, so let's bump that back up. Get a little more leadership under the belt. This could be a really big matchup against Ohio State. Literally no hiccups. The Buckeyes suck. Wait, Ohio State's 0-4 in the Big Ten? What is happening in the Big Ten? No way. This is the grossest I've ever seen the Big Ten. We are living in an alternate universe. We're 11th in the nation, taking on Ohio State. I mean, I still want to play this game. This is not the big game I thought it would be. We're definitely going to want wear and tear to be exactly where we need to be. Do not want to get hurt in this game. We're almost maxed out leadership. It's really nice when you don't got to study. I got 20 skill points. It's definitely the fastest we've ever recruited skill points, too. They're making this senior season really fun. I can max out elusiveness now, but I'm not going to do that. Honestly, IQ, while I don't think it's that important, I think I'm gonna get a nice overall boost for this because awareness is usually pretty important. That one right there took me up to a 93 overall. I have a 99 play action stat. Let's take a look at our physical abilities. We still haven't been able to get off platform because we need 90 throw power. So let's go for that next. Power is gonna cost me 10 big ones, but I do have 90 throw power now. So I'm at least able to activate off platform. I've already got pull down, gold tier mobile dead eye, and then silver sleight of hand and extender. So let's make pull down silver and off platform bronze with our next upgrade, but we're officially a 94 overall. We got to be one of the best players in college ball. The sim has been very nice to me too. Let's see how the stats are looking. We're throwing 28 and three, almost 2000 yards halfway through the season. That is gorgeous. Our number one wide receiver is actually Casey Freeman, who's got nine touchdowns. Godwin looks like he's not getting a lot of touches, but the touches he's getting are monstrous. He's averaging 22 yards per reception. He's got seven touchdowns. Cole Kowski and Makai White are also pitching in a little bit here, but uh, Casey Freeman looks like he's the number one guy. He's probably our slot wide receiver, if that's the case. And on the ground, Brock. Wait, what? This is not the halfback I saw before. He's not having a great season. As many touchdowns as fumbles. That is a Polish last name, and he kind of looks Polish. Brock Kalaja. This is not the running back I saw before. We have an injury? A little confused here. Take a look at halfbacks. Am I blind? Did I accidentally switch to the wrong team or did something happen? I'm not sure, but we've got a new halfback. 83 overall, 92 speed, 92 acceleration, which I do like better. We do have two injuries, an 86 overall middle linebacker. He's out for three more weeks, so we will have him for hopefully a playoff push. Our Darius Mitchell, a stud at left tackle, has got a torn bicep. He's not coming back this season, I don't think. Let's take a look at the Heisman watch too. Heisman watch, are we in it? Oh, we are, dude, the sim is so nice to me. So in the lead is Notre Dame's wide receiver. Brett Gillikin. So we're not in first, but we're up there. Let's go have a huge outing against Ohio State and get us there. So it'll be our first full game as a Maryland Terrapin. Now, one thing I am a little bit sad about. So the Terrapins have some of the coolest alternate unis I've ever seen in college football because they have that really cool flag design. Unfortunately, it's not in the game. We got some really cool home away and alternates, multiple alternates, actually. You can rock some really cool colors. Unfortunately, I can't do too much. I could throw on the red pants. I mean, the, the Buckeyes are still 92 overall. How they've lost every Big Ten game is beyond me. I still think this is going to be a really tough team to play despite a 
horrible start to the year for the Buckeyes. The Mark L. Butler tunnel, I gotta say, I don't know much about Maryland football. I have not watched a lot of games, but I love their mascot, I love their colors, and this is my first look at Maryland Stadium. That's why I love Maryland, dude, that flag design that they do, like in the end zone, sometimes on the helmets, it's so sick. <laughs> the big turtle. Ohio State starts with a touchdown. I'm telling you, this is still a good team. Do I start the game out how I always start games out? Do I just go to Isaac Godwin? Just see how he looks. He's got him beat, but they got two over the top. We're gonna try and hit this dig. Great catch. Let's hand it off to our Polish man, who's gonna have a lot of yards to run. Clean pocket. Oh, that's a sketchy ball. What a great catch. I can't let the record, like, deceive me. This is still a crazy good team. I'm hoping those linebackers blitz. No, but that wheel route could be money. Ooh, no, I was just about to take a shot. Why are you doing that right now? I just got sacked for, like, 20 yards. <laughs> Fans are getting a little nervous. This is an undefeated Maryland team, and it's third and 16 here against the Buckeyes. Let's try and put us in field goal range with a little slip screen. Catch them off guard. Maybe get it? No. Should be a good field goal though. It's a 51 yard field goal. We learned about our kicker today too. Kicker missed, but defense stepped up 7-0. See if we can run a wide receiver screen here. See some blocks, gentlemen. Good blocking. Middle of the field. Ooh, that was scary, but great blocks. I'm gonna fight. I'm so shocked I haven't fumbled. I've got, I've taken so many big hits in my career. Right behind the defense. They're sleeping. I don't wanna be an Isaac Godwin merchant. I did that all last season. I think I can get around him. He's pretty big. Shoot. Shoot. Dude, this D-line. Tell you what, man, I might have been better off letting the boys play. Wait, but that's a beautiful scene. Pick it up. That's an interception? Oh, no. If I'm 0-2 against Ohio State on my career, I'm going to be very sad. 14-0. to This is not looking good. I might have to reach into my merchant little bag and just go to Godwin. <laughs> I think I got him. Oh, no, that's underthrown. Maher, doesn't matter. He overplayed it. DB didn't get his head around. He didn't see that I underthrew that ball. All right, let's put Kalads on a deep crosser. See if he can sit behind that defense. Got a few check downs if needed. Right there. Beautiful. I love that hitch. Can you get in? No, it's first and goal. Godwin's got position. He does. Godwin, get in there, buddy. It was ugly, but we're on the board. Halftime, we start with ball. Need it right now. Let's make a push, boys. We got to get the stadium back into it, too. I need that home field advantage, right? They're leaving this hitch. They're covering deep really well, but they're leaving the short yardage stuff. I just gotta be patient today. Gosh, that's good coverage. <gasps> no way. I gotta make a tackle. First tackle, first, no, stop. It's gonna be one of the first tackles of my career. That's such a bad ball. We can't go out like this, boys, our senior season. We got something to prove. All right, second time's the charm, baby. No. God, win. My career was built on the backs of fast wide receivers who catch tough balls. I've been air raid here and Ohio State's picking up on it. Let's get back to the run. Or maybe I had the right idea. Ooh, blitz right over top of that. I've been a little hitch demon today. Third and one, we're going inside. Oh, RPO peak slant. I like this. Go, Colads. No. Fourth and three. Coach, you gotta let me go for this. We kicked this field goal. I think we're I think we're losing. Kicker missed. Or maybe the sim went for it. I don't know what just happened, but we have the ball at better field position now. Broken tackle, Maher! Extender, that's why we get silver tier extender. Huge touchdown, needed it bad. 21 to 14, a giant stop from the defense. This game is not over, baby. We got the Texas. We got the Texas route. Oh, fourth quarter, clock's winding down. Down by seven against Ohio State. I can't lose every game of my career to Ohio State, right? Not only do we need this touchdown, but we need defense to step up big one more time. Even if we get the touchdown, they've not respected the hitch all game. Come on, baby. I believe Godwin's got him beat. It's a great ball, Godwin. This is it, boys. Our whole season comes down to this. Be patient. Can you make that throw, Maher? Back foot dot. It's so slightly underthrown, but that is such a good ball turning like that. We cannot give Ohio State a bunch of clock to win this game. We almost can get to a position where we let our kicker win this. Let's see. No, stop. That whole line is getting bullied. Third and 16, our undefeated streak on the line. We need field goal range here. We don't necessarily need the first down. I need about 10 yards to make this manageable for our kicker. The Texas route, maybe. Collage caught. It's a 53 yard field goal. I don't know. I don't know what coach is gonna do here. He missed one big one already. Fourth and six. This is the biggest kick of our kicker's life. I'm gonna switch it to slow so we can watch this go down. The kick, it's a punt. Second and six. Third and six, overtime. Oh my God, we're in overtime, Maher! That's a blitz. B, you got position. Great catch. I'm staying on this camera angle. I know this is unorthodox, but it's overtime. We're in a big game. I wanna see Maher in all his glory. Great check down. That's a first down, move the sticks, baby. We get in this end zone, we get that PAT, we're gonna put Ohio State in a tough spot. Double team on the left side. I love to see that. 
I could throw the Texas or I could take off. Get out of bounds. It's a direct snap to Kolods, the Polish Punisher. Take it to him, buddy. Take it to him. Overtime. Touchdown. Maryland taking on the Buckeyes at home. The fans got what they paid for today. Okay, we get our PAT. Ohio State's on offense. They score instantly. Ohio State scores. We got to tie this thing back up. Let's put a double team on this side. Dude, when I am rolling out, it's the best that I play. Let's see if they can hold that edge rusher. They do. No, maybe not, but that's a good ball. Maher! This is our season right here. Fourth and seven. Kowalkowski's got him burned on the slant. Great catch! That's a blocking tight end. Don't forget. And I'm going to have him blocking right here. Same thing. I want to be able to roll out here. Give me a double team on that guy on the right side. Just give me a time. Okay, let's step up on this one. Give it to him. No! I tried to give that to Kolods, but they got to me a little too quick. Second and 11. Overtime ball game. Beautiful. Oh, RB, clear, clear, no! The story of the game, interceptions. Maher, taking on the two and five Buckeyes, and I throw a second overtime interception. Ohio State came into our house against a ranked Maryland team, takes us down. Let me see this last play here. I wonder if it looked different from this angle. So we had the rollout. I just felt like we had him here. I felt like we had the step but he reacted so well and oh, what a play. Our first loss of the season is the first game I step in on. That hurts. That's not fun to see. Next game's against Northwestern. I think I gotta get us right. I think I gotta get us a win. I'm scared to sim it, if I'm being honest. Are they gonna let a 10 and two Maryland team in if we lose here? It's not a ranked opponent. I don't wanna step in here against Northwestern. Let's test our luck. We're six and two. We need a, a big 10 game. Oh no. We play both UCLA and Michigan. That's what's gonna save us. All right, left on the schedule. Michigan State, Minnesota, Michigan, UCLA. We have two of the best programs in the entire nation as our last two games. I don't know if that'll get us a Big Ten championship game, but we have to win those two games. I'm headed into the big house to take a number five Michigan who has yet to lose a single game this season. And we're ranked again. We're 19th in the nation. We have to win these next two games. It's, it's a must. We've got eight skill points. No studying to do. So let's take a little more XP, add a skill point. Let's make sure we're fully healthy for Michigan. Max out our leadership. And let's add some abilities. We're going to add off platform for improved accuracy, cross box or back foot. And with nine skill points, I could get platinum tier mobile Deadeye, but I'm just gonna boost pull down. Ball security in the pocket. We got three skill points left. We'll hang on to those for now. Eventually, I wanna do quickness. I wanna be faster. Oh, this is a big game. Michigan has so many demons on this squad. Look at their offensive line. Guard, 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 tackle, tackle. Oh my God, that's insane. Their quarterback, Angel Monty, a scrambler with platinum tier magician and option king. 93 overall with 95 speed. Everything we got right now against Michigan. We're going into the big house too, which is horrifying. I'm gonna rock the all black alternates. I need black Air Force energy going into this game. I need it. Yo, these unis look so clean. It's zero to zero. We start with the ball in the big house. You know it's gonna be loud. And a five yard rush is a great way to start. Hey, it's loud and my audibles are clapped. Gotta take the check down here. We just gotta quiet the crowd. Once we quiet the crowd, this game will get a whole lot easier. Hey, I wanted to come to the Big Ten, right? I want to come to the Big Ten, right? Heat in my face as I throw. This is something else. Michigan scores. I think I need to scramble. Can I even max protect? I can't even max protect. You're open. Cole odds. Huge catch. 7-0 at the end of the first. I think I took North Carolina for granted, man. That defense was great, and um, we had a lot of momentum. Okay, stadium's quieted down a little bit. I can actually audible. A little bit of room here. This is a risky throw across body. At least we got rid of it. Beautiful, Maher. We need that. We needed that bad. First and 10. I just got intentional grounding. Okay, you got to get out there. Dude, we're just bagged. Third and 25, and Coach is just calling runs. He's conceding. Coach just letting it go. I mean, I put us in this position. And that's a punt. Michigan calls a timeout. They want to score. I really hope they don't. They don't score. Great work. Defense. Defense. Defense put us in God tier position here. The middle just vacated. We're gonna do it with our legs. Come on, boys. Okay, a good play right there. We can make audibles. I wanna double team on that edge. I wanna be able to move. Good block. Great block. Okay, Baxter is so fast. That guy is horrifying. I really like the slip screen here. Let's pick up an easy two. Oh my God, they're on me so fast. Great blocks. Great blocks, Kolods. Do it for all of Poland, Kolods. I'm looking for a seam beater if this is zone. Roten's there. That's the seam beater. That's what I want. Let's go! Maryland takes the lead in the big house. Michigan gets a field goal, and the crowd's back in it. All coach wants is play action here. I hate that coach. Coach, I hate this. This line is gonna collapse. Play action. I think that's A. It is, and he catches it. That one of the biggest plays of the game right there. Empty trio slants. I can't audible. Somebody get open for me. 
I think your ex. Yes, it is. Yes. I had a guess. There's Maryland, 19th in the nation at eight and two. Both of our losses come in Big Ten games. That's bad. Maryland's coach loves play action. I think he forgot who we're playing. That or he knows something I don't. Here's the play action. Got it. White has been clearing on that side all day. Makes a huge juke. Take us down to the two. It's motion, third and goal. Kolod's in motion. Two man rush, can I step up? Can we step up? Maher stepping up, big time in this pocket. Only one passing touchdown, but two rushing. 21 to 10, we can all but close this game. Michigan's got a single timeout. We've been efficient offensively, but I gotta give a lot to my defense. Only 10 points out of Michigan here, making our job real easy. We just run this clock out, punt the ball, take this puppy home. Nah, we're just gonna hand this off. Cut it up, Colods. Ball game. Into the big house, caught the W. Thank you. What a huge quality of life improvement too, where the whole clock runs if you're in victory formation. 21 to 10, Maryland's hopes for the college football playoffs are still alive. We throw 11 for 16 in a touchdown, but on the ground is, is really where we were big. Two touchdowns on the ground. That's what you expect out of the former Heisman. I could still compete for the Big Ten Championship. It would be a rematch versus Michigan. If we win here against UCLA, it'd be me versus Michigan again. Let's drop some points into XP and let's recover and I got energy to spend. I guess I'll be an influencer today. Oh, it's another home game. Tough. Two big games on the road. The number 11 Maryland Terrapins taking on six in the nation UCLA Bruins. The Big Ten is very strong right now. A lot of good teams in the Big Ten. And if you think I'm not rocking all black, you're out of your mind. This game is so big too, because right now we're technically a playoff team. But if we lose, I don't think we make it. So we got a big goal game to play. This is the most room I've had in a minute. Maher! Is that the longest rush of my career right there? I have not been using Godwin to his full potential either, but I ha can't really audible. I can't give him a streak. These audibles have been so tough. One thing I can tell you right now, though, is UCLA's D-line is nowhere near what Michigan or Ohio State's was. I'm sure, I have no doubt this is a great team, but I don't see stars. I see one star down there, and, I mean, you can just feel it. Michigan, Ohio State, you better get that ball out. Also, this stadium, I mean, the Bruins are a good team, but this is nothing like Michigan. It was so much tougher in Michigan. Great route. Great throw. It's a first. I wonder how I'm looking in the Heisman running now after my three interception game against Ohio State. I don't, I don't think it looks good. Okay, let's go with the classic. Got a Texas route. Can we step up? We can. We got a little bit of time. Can I get it off? No, he's so open. Third and 10, big play. Just gotta stand and deliver a throw. UCLA's on the board first after an empty drive. Slip screen here. This has got big play written all over it. Give me a good block. Decent block. Third and four, another big play. Oh, big blitz. Get it off quick. Huge catch. You know, for a blocking tight end, Kowalkowski's got some hands. I just gotta get this off. That dude was on a double team. Flag might be a roughing the passer. No. It's a hold. Third and 28, I'm getting bulldozed back here. And coach is gonna set up for the punt. I hate that coach, I do, but I get it. Look at this dude. It's just like Ohio State. I need your defense. First and 10, I need it Godwin. I need it Godwin. He's got the step. I didn't hit him in stride. He had to jump for it, but hey, look at how quickly we got down the field and quieted the crowd. Good double, spectacular double. I'm taking off. Get it over the top. Somebody, right? Somebody catch it. I think that was Godwin. It was. 7 to 14. We needed something there. UCLA can't score. Coach is calling QB Neal. We're going. We're going into halftime. We've got some momentum with that big touchdown. We're down by seven at half. And I think I start with the ball. Oh, it's music to my ears. A non-star corner in single coverage. Godwin, this is going to you, buddy. Just come down with it. Oh my God, he's got him torched. I think that's a hold. No, it's a hold. It's a three-man rush. Oh, the biggest play of the game just came back. Nice blitz here. I just got to take what I can get, and what I can get is absolutely nothing. Godwin. Hey, I just saw you do it, Godwin. Do it again. Broken tackle. First and goal. I'm a Godwin. I'm a merchant, dude. I think if you don't give me 99 speed, I don't know that I go to the playoffs. And this game isn't even over yet. Good inside zone from Kolods. Take it up to the five. An RPO peak slant. Okay, I actually like this play call, coach. Those linebackers blitz, we rifled this to Y. Nope, they're staying home. Gotta hand this puppy off. Our backup takes it to the three. Now it's third and goal. I'm the Heisman. You gotta let me throw. Okay, RB wide open. Tie ball game. Big defensive stop. Is that what I saw? 14 of 14. How am I running? I got nothing. 
and I got an intentional grounding. There was straight up not a soul open right there. Here we go, boys. Third and 22. The biggest conversion of the game our entire season on the line. It's all tied up. Clear. Over the top. Kowalkowski. Push. Fourth and one. Coach, please. Let me go for it. He's not going to let me go for it. Defense, we need one more out of you. Hopefully it's a good punt here. Fourth and one, UCLA gets nothing. We got the ball back on the five. They they went three and out and they punted. Inside rush. I can scramble. Y is wide open. Not the best ball, but we'll take it. It's slip screen, which is risky. But if we can pick this up, it'll be a hell of a play call. Get in behind your blockers. We're punting the ball again. Oh, this is the Terps whole season right here. We've only got two timeouts. UCLA can almost milk it and kick a field goal. Depends how this drive goes. Defense. Do you see what I see? 14 to 14, do you see what I see? Play action. Godwin has it. Godwin dropped, underthrown. That's on me. Second and 10, who's home? Easy one. Make it manageable, beautiful. <laughs> the juke, he's out of bounds. Fake jet halfback scene. You know what I like about this? Oh my God, that might be the best ball of my career. Godwin! Oh, that was the best ball I've ever thrown. Victory formation. We survived the gauntlet. Michigan down, UCLA down. We're headed to the playoffs. We have to. 304 passing yards and three touchdowns. 14 for 23, 60% completion, 304 and three. Take me home. Defense deserves so much credit for holding UCLA in that whole fourth quarter. Now we can find out where exactly we are, who we're playing. I think we're playing Michigan again, no? Damn right we are. We're six in the nation now. We've been invited to play in the Big Ten Championship in week one against Michigan. Michigan. Big Ten Championship. This is the game I wanted. This is why I went over to the Big Ten. I cannot tell you the last time Maryland won the Big Ten. I don't know that they ever have. We will have a minor wear and tear here against Michigan. A few accuracies are down. My right arm's hurting a bit, and I'm minus two speed. No bueno. Uh, with eight, we could do elusiveness. We cannot upgrade accuracy anymore. We've maxed out what we can do on accuracy, so it's elusiveness, which would increase my break sack. I'm gonna upgrade extender. Breaking a sack is so big. I'm gonna take gold tier extender. Improve break sack ability. Big 10 championship versus Michigan. Let's get our redemption right here. And this time it ain't in the big house. So this should be a lot easier for us. Woo! Look at that. Half the stadium's Michigan. Half the stadium is Maryland. It's going to be so much easier with a neutral site here. I, I swear half the problem Michigan was so tough was just, oh my God. He caught that. Oh my God. Half the reason Michigan was so tough though was the big house. Without the big house, I can call audibles. I can see my receivers. This is gonna be easier for us. And look at that. I can audible to a Texas and drop the ball. <laughs> Second attempt, we're already at midfield though. Yikes. Yikes. I fumbled, but we picked it up. We just lost about 20 yards. This Dexter dude is the bane of my existence. I'm going Kowalkowski here. He's got the edge. He's turning the corner. First down, Maryland. That's my boy, Kowalkowski. You know, I was talking shit about him and started season. He's got 77 speed. I want to make this a manageable field goal. Let's put up some points here, yeah? Oh, that's that looks money. Can we get those blocks? Can we get the first down? He opts for the edge, and it's the right call. Another crucial first down. Jesus. This guy's unblockable, but guess what? Extender. I broke a sack. Yeah, this ain't the big house anymore, big boy. God, he's a freak. <laughs> he's such a freak, but that's a great ball. Way to cut it up. Almost there, one yard to go, boys. Jet touch pass is pretty money on the goal line. And I really like how their defense looks for this. They're way too center aligned. Money. That's just too easy right there. Maryland's in the end zone and I get the freest passing touchdown of my life. Reset, post Ooh. over the top. Guess who? And coach is setting up for the conceit. It's third and 10 and all he's let me run is counter. Maryland's coach does not have big balls. That much I'm certain of. Defense steps up after halftime. We'll start on offense and we just gotta get out of the danger zone here. Oh my God, look at that spin move he just did. And I just, he's so fast. Look at this, he just, he's doubled here. I can't even get around him. Come on boys, second and eight. We gotta step up, we gotta step up big. I finally can scramble, it feels so good. It's the start of the fourth quarter, down nine points in the Big Ten Championship. I'm gonna put Cole out, says my, oh beautiful. I love that route. I love it, third and four. Go slants middle, keep this simple. Come on buddy. Collards. I feel, yeah, we have to go for this. Thank you, coach. Fourth and two, we're going for it. The Big Ten Championship on the line. I'm doubling Baxter. I got a few routes that can get this right there. Easy one, Godwin. Trusting our best receiver at the biggest point of the game. Now with two minutes left, we have to score and we got to score quick. Oh, I got him over the top. I got him. Good ball. Let's go. Clock's not moving. Chains are resetting. Okay, we got a crosser out of Freeman. Oh, oh, great release. Maher. Oh, that's huge. Second and 10. The drive is still alive. Can't be rattled. Step up. Step up. 
I love it. Come on, boys. I got a Texas on cold odds. That's what I'm looking for. If it ain't there, it ain't there. I'm taking the easy one. Make this manageable or fight. Third and goal from the two. But that clock's ticking. I'm running it. Third and goal. There it is. Bruh. Put up the field, buddy. Cut up. Fourth and goal. We need it. I don't know if that's there. Oh, no. We're six in the name. I don't know if we get a college football playoff spot after this loss. We just use all it. Yeah, it's over. I mean, we got to get the onside kick. But Michigan goes nowhere. Punts the ball. Got to do this, right? I might have it. Godwin. It's a money ball to Godwin. We get down here in no time. Keep clearing. Nobody. I'm sacked. This, this ball game is over. If by some miracle we still get to the playoffs, I hope I get a rematch against Michigan, man. I really feel like I failed my team here today. Dude. Oh, what a heartbreaker, man. We weren't even in the big house. There's no excuse on this one. This is the most frustrating part of our season. Inside zone's a risky call here when the clock's ticking. But just look at this. Oh, just cut up. Cut up or dive or do anything. Look at how close you are. You just ran straight at the backer. Cut to the right or juke or spin or do anything. Pain and suffering. I don't know what this is gonna look like for our season now. I tried to prove so much by going to Maryland. I could have gone LSU, I could have gone to Michigan. And I wanted to prove something and it hasn't panned out how we wanted. Heisman doesn't go to us either. And honestly, we didn't deserve it. 2028 Heisman winners, KJ Jackson, senior at Arkansas. We do win first team all Big 10. Almost 4,000 yards, 43 touchdowns and 10 interceptions. A bit of a regression in our senior year, I'm not gonna lie. What is this? I can't believe it. I, I did not think we were going. We only fell two ranking points there by losing to Michigan. Take it on LSU. I hope I get redemption. I pray Michigan makes it all the way through. We're taking on LSU, the five-star that we could have gone to in the college football playoffs. They're really giving me a shot, huh? Taking XP, bringing our health back up. We have minus two speed. Let's look at the bracket. Oh yeah, Michigan got the bye. So in the All-State Bowl, we take on number one Georgia if we win. And then if Michigan beats either Oregon or New Mexico, we'll play Michigan. Gifted a playoff spot. That's how it feels right now. Oh my God, there's not a lot of Maryland here. Are you kidding? It's all LSU. Whatever. We've been the underdog in all these games, man. A wide open. No! I thought that was a hitch. I s and I missed the time. I saw the play art wrong because of the stadium pulse. I thought it was a hitch and it wasn't. Dude, I'm like, I'm getting worse by the second. No, no we're not. We're in the college football playoffs for a reason. We're gonna win it for a reason too. I see X. I can't even see your icon, but I see you, buddy. Breaks a tackle. I love the slip screen. I don't like you following your blocks. Like, it must be his awareness or something because I noticed that Colod's compared to my other backs just doesn't have good vision. Got him. Got him that time. Godwin torched him. 99 release for a reason, but I just can't hit him in stride right now. Ooh. No, you're so fast. I broke it. I broke it. Extender. I, I'm like reading all these plays on the fly because I can't see them. Can I do something miraculous here? All right. That's fine, honestly. I have no idea what I'm running. He just... You know what I really took for granted was North Carolina's offensive line. LSU puts up another touchdown. We get a, only a field goal out of that, and um, maybe I'm a fraud. Second and 10, three timeouts. Honestly, the slip screen is one of Maryland's best plays. We run a really good slip screen. Beauty. Look at the yards on this. If you follow your blockers. Colas, I don't know what they're teaching you over there in Poland, brother, but this ain't it. All right, good catch. Okay, stadium's quieter. Stadium's quieter. Are you going to clear? Oh, he was going to clear. Godwin. No, I thought it was a streak! And it's an interception! Oh my god! I thought it was a streak. I looked on play art, but it's too loud! See, like, that looks like he's gonna run a streak. This is actually a sick play. Wide receiver mid-screen, and this goes to Godwin. See if we get the time for it. It's bagged. It's so bagged. He followed him all the way. I gotta settle down. If we want even a chance of winning the college football playoffs, I gotta settle down. White, we don't need Godwin when you got a release like that! Let's go, White! breaks the tackle into the end zone. This game ain't over. LSU just scored again though, I think. 20 to nine? Did we go for two and not get it? Godwin, Godwin. I'm a merchant, I know, I'm a streak merchant, but I love it! Godwin, don't look back. Get your ass in there. Maryland's alive, we're going for two here. Big two point conversion. Let's see what those linebackers do. It's gonna determine how we play this. Big roll, big roll, step up Maher. Keep it simple. 17 to 20 against LSU. Come on boys. Okay. I'm gonna throw this. Mm -hmm. Is that a throw past the line of scrimmage? Greedy pass right there. I had my yards. Second 15, I can't audible. It's too loud in here, but I will have the Texas. I won't have the Texas because I missed the throw. Third and 15. Yes, follow him. 
Fourth and 10, we gotta go for it, right? Coach is going for it, hell yeah! Fourth and 10, the stadium's loud! It's real loud! We need it right here, right now. He's there, he's there! No! That was the biggest throw! We still have three timeouts, I need defense. Only a field goal out of LSU and it was a quick field goal. We burnt a timeout. How'd I miss that? We're cranked on accuracy. I'm throwing short until we get our ass in that end zone. Let's let there be no time left when we score here, boys. Maryland's entire season on the line, and he clears. Great catch. No need to no huddle. I want this clock gone by the time I'm in that end zone. Way to step up, Maher. Keep it simple. Let that clock tick. I gotta have big plays every time, or, or we're gonna be stuck here like this. Beautiful. Vacated the middle. Godwin takes eight. Hopefully that quieted the crowd so I can actually see. It did. I can see. I can't audible, but I can see at least for a bit. Third and four. Zone, it is. Soft spot. Massive play by that safety. Fourth and four. I've got Freeman on this hitch. I'm going to block Colods. How are we looking, boys? Oh, big blitz. There's the hitch. Broken up. That's our season. No, it's not. How do we have the ball? They could have gone victory formation. This game isn't over. I can't see shit. We're back in the same spot. I'll take a yard and out of bounds. Take it, get the first, and get out of bounds. Huge play, Colods. First and 10, clock is stopped. I have to get rid of this ball if I can't get anything. Great blocks, I can roll. RB, beauty, get out of bounds, buddy. Or, yes, yes. First and 10, we've been gifted a miracle drive. I don't know how they didn't run that clock out. Great roll. Oh, uh, I need you out of the way, Colod, so I can step up, but that works. 14 seconds left in the red zone. RB! No! Oh! I saw that linebacker vacate. I needed a quicker ball and a shorter ball. This senior season's been a nightmare. My draft stock has tanked. I tell you what, college football 25 is no joke, man. You know what, LSU? I hope you beat Michigan, though. So here's what I saw. Soon as the snap goes, look at that linebacker drop off. I thought this was just the freest touchdown. I tried to throw it instantly, too. But this ball just comes out way too out and way too forward. I want it right now, right where he is. Tough close to the season, man. To end my college career like that is sad. Don't tell me Michigan won it. Please, just not Michigan. Ooh, LSU lost to Georgia. Michigan and Georgia play. Georgia wins, and Georgia wins the national championship by five against Notre Dame. Oh, we got gifted a playoff berth, too. Hey, we took the Maryland Terrapins to eighth in the nation. I'm excited about that, but it's about time I leave for the NFL. It's not all bad, though. We had a really good career, but in our senior season, we really couldn't show off everything that we were made of. A slight regression from our North Carolina years. A lot more interceptions, and they were all on me. Got sacked more, too. Definitely the highlight of our college career was our junior year with North Carolina, 4,385, 46, and 7. It was still a good season, but took a risk on Maryland, and it was aggressive. All right, boys. Well, that was the full career of Matthew Maher, the quarterback. We played a lot of football, and I doubt you'll ever see someone play with these three teams again. Hopefully, I can import this player into Madden. How sick would that be? Either way, it was a hell of a season, and it's time that we head to the league. Oh, and you can. I could export my player to Madden, or I could retire from college football. All right, boys. Hell of a season. Hell of a year. I appreciate you guys for watching. As always, Sorry it wasn't the close this season that we wanted, but it was still an excellent journey. I love y'all, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace!